Okay, guys, I want to let you know before we get into the videos that you guys are going to be seeing over the next few weeks, few months of the J100, but I want to let you know why that is. We have to be honest with you guys. The reason that we're looking at a potentially another spray drone is DJI. This is the DJI T50. This currently, in my opinion, is the best spray drone system available in the US. It's just, it's user friendly. It is really good in what it does. So that being said, we are looking at other options like the EA Vision J100, but the reason we are is because DJI is in hot water with the US government. If you guys aren't aware, I'll just quickly give you a brief story. There was a bill that was proposed at the in the house that went to the Senate to try to get DJI banned in America. That bill did not go through because we made our voices heard and the Senate did not pass it. Well, that didn't go through, meaning that they could ban them. So this other thing came up and it's so political. I don't want to really get into it, but this other thing came up that they said, oh, DJI is using forced labor to build their drones. And so what that did is when it comes to the border, US border looks at your paperwork and it stops it at the border and it doesn't allow it to come in. I know this because I personally had some things turned around and gone back. So that being said, it is very difficult to get a lot of inventory into the country. So the demand of spray drones, demand of enterprise drones, thermal drones, uh, inspection drones, it doesn't matter, is up like crazy and DJI builds the best systems. It's just the way it is. They own like 75 to 80% of the world drone market. And so these DJI systems are very good, but we can't get enough in to keep up with demand to supply it. So we're trying to figure out, we have to look at other options available like the J100 that do the same project that this drone does. Might be a little bit more of a learning experience, it might be difficult, it might do things that the DJI drone doesn't do, and this and that. So I'm basically just letting you guys know that these videos that are coming up, it's not to bash one drone or the other drone. It is to show you that this might be an option. In my opinion, again, I do believe the DJI is the best system, but we can't get enough of them into the country right now to keep up with the demand. That being said, I wanna be honest with you as we go forward into these videos, what my opinion is on the J100 and how I feel going forward. We're still getting DJI drones in for our inventory. We currently have T50s in inventory here at New Way Ag. It's just, it's harder to get them. And so if you are wanting to get into a DJI drone sooner rather than later, now's the time because we have inventory. Sometimes they get backed up. It might take two weeks. It might take three weeks to get them in. Anyhow, I wanted to let you know we are not giving up on DJI drones. I believe that they are really, really good. So not giving up on them, but making another option available. 